The nurse is organizing a staff development session on diabetic ketoacidosis, DKA. Which of the following information should be emphasized? A. The treatment goal is to reduce blood glucose levels by 50 to 75 milligrams per deciliter per hour, 2.775 to 4.165 millimoles per liter per hour. B. Dextrose, 5% in water, D5W, should be available to manage hypoglycemic symptoms. C. Hypovolemia caused by DKA can be treated with 3% saline. D. Urine output will increase once regular insulin therapy begins. Correct answer. A rationale. DKA involves hypoglycemia greater than 250 mg per deciliter, acidosis, hyperkalemia, and ketonuria. The primary goal is to reduce blood glucose gradually by 50 to 75 mg per deciliter per hour using intravenous regular insulin. This prevents complications like cerebral edema. Insulin therapy continues until acidosis resolves. Once glucose drops to 200 mg per deciliter, d 51 ns is added to prevent hypoglycemia while managing acidosis.